Hey guys, today I'll be showing you my ultimate base. I hope you guys like it. So, um, but before we start, I've got something that you need to do and it just takes five seconds. Hit that like button, smash the subscribe button and hit the notification so you don't miss any new video. <laughs> So, the first place we're going to show is here on the base. It's basically the place where money and shields are kept. Over here is where the shields are kept. See? Some shields fell down already. Spike shields and then just close it. And then over here we have got... It's a bit hard to open it. But here we've got cash. There is quite a lot of cash. The blue ones mean a, a trillion. And we've got two, so that means two trillion. The silver bars are basically worth one billion. And over here we've got cash as well. 100 bucks, two gold bars and... The red one means two billion. Okay, now we're going to um, explain about these potions, the potion storage. Each color potion means a different type of thing. So the blue ones, the these type of blue, basically mean a huge laser, laser ball which you can throw. These blue ones mean that you can shoot l small laser balls. This blue one means you can have the power of ice. This light blue one means you have the power of water, so you can make tsunamis, stuff like that. The green ones are mostly about he healing. This one's healing. This, these ones these ones are about a huge green um healing bubble these one means a whole range of poison these ones mean you can have an elite warrior stack um so that means you're basically gonna have lots of warriors the yellow ones get you electrifying sorry um, the yellow ones are going to give you electrifying um, power, which electrifies your enemy. The red one, this red one means you have the power of fire. These ones mean you can have, you can shoot red laser balls. The golden one means that you can use so much power that you can send in a trillion warriors and then this orange one means the power of lava these orange ones are basically the power of fire so moving on to the kitchen you have to kind of take this off so you can see properly and then take this and then you can take this and yeah you can properly see here we've got a sink and then crimps like cream like crimp i mean peach soap and then a golden tap and we've got a water spout where you just need to press on here and then water comes out this is the hand dryer instead of like a normal towel and here we've got a few red mugs and one white mug a, a bottle of milk a bottle of hot chocolate milk and then yeah coffee energy drinks here we've got some fruit blueberries um um, here we've got strawberries and then grapes. Here we've got another stash of strawberries 
I mean strawberries and blueberries, then chocolate cake and strawberry cake over here. Then we've got another stash of two two cakes and two fully cupcakes and then four chocolate cakes. Here we've got candy and then but over here we've got four bananas. Here we've got ice cream. We've got three squishy candies and then here we've got an apple and then over here we've got one um, cupcake and inside we have, wait let me just take it off, we've got two sausages and one chicken, just put it back. And here we've an oven, here, right here, you can open the door, you can open the door of the oven and cook the chicken. And that's done for the kitchen. Now moving on to the stash of weapons. So here we have like a guard's kit, like an executioner's execution knife, a um, big um, axe. This is a normal sized axe for an executioner. Here's a machine gun. Here's the magazine where all the bullets are stored. Here's a double sided laser axe for um, people who love olden time weapons and here's another laser axe but one sided with a iron spike and a force blow at the back here we've got a regular sword which all of you must know a chained mace is like this it's got chained and you can whack it like that here we've got a chainsaw but coloured We've got a dark laser knife and a light laser knife. And we've got TNT and a machine gun. Here we've got a barbecue grill. Here's the fire and here's the bits where you put the tools on. But I don't really have any of the tools for the barbecue grill and then here we've got um, a robot and um, if you see its arms are here what do you guys guess these are of course this one's a long long distance frag bomb this is a machine gun a missile and then here we've got some shields over here and then a rocket a rocket launcher here we've got a cannon up here right here let me just show you how cool it is just wait one minute because i've got the thing for it so we just put this in here and then wait let me just do this never mind i found a different one so then you lock and load and then put it back on and then fire and same on this side, except this one's power. Right there. Smashed it. Here we've got a power hammer right here. It gives a force blow to your opponent, getting time um, for them, getting time for you to retreat if you need, or even give you space to heal before they come and attack you. And then it already um, destroys 20% of their lives. And then here's Spider-Man. Here's a police officer. Here's a saber tooth tiger. <sighs> it can really move, like, except its arms and legs. It can move, like, in the back joints and the head joint. Yeah. And here we've got a training area where you can train and attack here's a blaster that you need to use or any other weapon 
Here we've got some crafting tables under here. Crafting table three. Weapons here. Rocket launchers. Laser guns. Machine guns. Um, grenade launchers. And an empty box. And then, yeah, cabinets for your base to put any random thing in there. And over here we've got a machine gun that we need to do is stand in there and then it'll keep and it'll shoot what we need to do is do this and then this and then stop shoot okay so it's not really that much of a regular base that i've made and here we've got a shield and then a warrior with a laser spear and a gun robot. And as well, the thing I was going to say was this is this really isn't the regular base I make. I might make a regular base soon, but not right now. So yeah. Here we've got um three guns, one mega machine gun, two laser blasters here and here and over here we've got a control pad and here we've got a gun so i hope you guys like it subscribe to see my other videos bye guys